So now we're going to take a step further in terms of our hip mobility and we're going to integrate it. So this, gets, this is a great exercise to get thoracic spine, hip mobility, glute activation, and even if you're really focused, you can get some dorsiflexion going back to module one as well. So this is called the pretzel stretch. Little integrated, little confusing at first. I'm going to start lying flat on my back. I'm going to bring my right knee about 90 degrees up. My left hand is going to grab my right knee and let it come over top. Now my right hand is going to reach and grab my, my left ankle. I'm going to pull my toes away from me, lock my glute out, pull both toes up, and now I'm, once again I'm tucking this, tip, this back glute tailbone, squeezing my glute, opening up my hip flexors, my hip flexors on my left leg, this hip flexor, this glute, and my thoracic spine through rotation. Now remember to breathe through this pretzel stretch as it can be somewhat constrictive. So you want to breathe into your diaphragm and exhale. And you can see the rise and fall. And each time I get a little bit more mobility, especially through my hip and my trunk. And I'm going to do the same thing now on the other side. So flat on my back, left knee comes over top, right hand grabs left knee, left hand palm up toward the ceiling so that I don't close off my shoulder girdle, keep it open, grab the ankle, pull my toes towards me, and I'm going to block out the back glute, breathe in through my diaphragm, and release. Now this stretch covers a lot of ground, so hip flexors, glutes, thoracic spine, and even a little bit of dorsiflexion that if you can activate and get that going as well. So try that one out.